Hi everybody, welcome to our November 12th version of Members, Members Only, Only Mondays. Mondays. And we are here on Monday after a full weekend of wrestling here at Gardner Webb. On Saturday we had Virginia and George Mason down for our November duels. And um, Joe, how'd that go? Uh, we wrestled Virginia first. You know, it was a tough duel. They're a pretty good, pretty solid team up and down their lineup. Um, I don't even know what the final score was. We had three. We had, we had three, they had a lot more than three. Um, but it, it, it opened our eyes for the things that we definitely need to work on. Um, you know, first so, real solid team that we saw this year, and it was our first duel of the year. So, you know, it was kind of an eye opener, but our guys wrestled hard. Still, I think a lot of good things, even though we didn't win nearly as many matches as we'd hoped. Um, and then we wrestled George Mason second. That was a better duel for us. Our guys kind of came out swinging hard. And they all got after it, wrestled hard, real competitive, um, you know, warrior spirit, and um, it was just it was a good duel for us. We ended up winning. What was it? I don't know the score there. 20, yeah. um, maybe twenty four to twelve or I think something. We lost three weights. And so overall, Mason was a much better duel for us. But uh, it's easy to go out against the teams that you you think you can compete compete with better. You know, you might have a better shot at beating them. Um, so I was just happy with with five freshmen or sophomores in our lineup after that something we took from Virginia to bounce back, come back strong in the next match, and new level of intensity. So that was good. Uh, did raise a little over three hundred dollars from our uh, ticket sales for the Movember movement. So that so that'll be good too. Where's your mustache, by the way? I shaved it off after the Movember duels. It's still Movember though. Yes. The month didn't change. Right? Yeah. I, I don't know. I just I, I couldn't deal with it anymore. Duck your pay. And then um, on Sunday, all of our freshmen in our red shirts were in action at the Wolfpack Open. Blevins, how'd that go? Went pretty good. Um, definitely, like Joe was saying, definitely saw uh, saw some things that we need to work on. Seeing the guys, for me, seeing the guys uh, in in competition, the younger guys in uh, in competition for the first time was uh, was definitely a treat. Um, getting to see. Getting to see how they actually look against against other other competitors was was nice, and I actually got the delivery of, of competing competing with them, coaching coaching them and competing with them. So that was that was fun too. A little bit of dual action for for Blevins there. So, uh, Kyle actually did win it. Took took first at 174. Got the t-shirt on. Sport and be, be proud here. Wolfpack Open champ. So the, it's no uh, belt. How's that belt, belt looking? It is a consolation prize uh, to the belt, I do got to say. Yeah, but the years past they've given out belts to the guys who won it, which is the only reason Kyle was, was in the tournament. And um, What can you do? I found out on Tuesday that they weren't given the belts, but didn't tell them. Sorry. Along with Kyle winning it, uh, Justin Cozera, heavyweight, took third. Cortez Stark, slow 25-pounder, ended up sixth. I think he went four and two on the day, five and two on the day, had a lot of wins. Okay. Austin Try and Kyle Ash were a match away from placing, had some some good yeah. wins. And so um, it's exciting. We're gonna keep rolling. Now this week we just full week of training. Next Monday we will host Belmont Abbey here at Garden Web at seven o'clock. So you guys got anything? Nope. No sir. Alrighty. We'll catch you guys next week for another edition of Members, Members Only, Only Mondays. Mondays. I'm really upset about his mustache. Oh, yeah. He just doesn't understand the art, right. the art of manliness. He shaved, shaved, his, shaved his beard. Shaved his beard and left the mustache for Saturday, and then he shaves off his mustache for... What's the matter, Joe? What was... <laughs> what was wrong with your mustache? I didn't like it. Well, you don't want like an idiot. I can't even take, take, take myself seriously. Look at me. Look, look, look at me. How do you look tough? <laughs> I gotta carry a stick around to beat the ladies off because my wife gets jealous. Unbelievable. I can't even grow a good mustache. Oh, yours looks great. Yours looks great.
Ooh, I wish I had a mustache for this. Oh, guess what, though? You don't. Why are you shaking it off? Oh, I look, I look stupid on me. My mustache doesn't look good. Look like an idiot with it. I didn't even notice that. He didn't have it this weekend, did he? 